But Chilpil is gonna be first up versus Beatman. The Paladin playing the Crusade. So he's playing for the two middle wings. Trying to see if he can maximize the most amount of damage. Chilpil is having to deal with the uh, Hodge. Got himself the full army of the dead together with a Valkyrie joining in. Valkyrie taking place of a Gargoyle. But basically functions the same. Gonna be Beatman getting Yoink back out in the open as they try to see if he can bail out of there. Wings for Crusade last for quite a long time, don't they? But they are in two minute cooldown, that means you won't be able to see these things for a good while. Triples does let him go for a simul action versus Beakman. That means he's able to steal one of his spells. I'm not sure which spell he's able to steal. I would imagine it most likely is going to be like a flash of light or something. Looks like the pet for Ghoul had to be resummoned for Chilpas as he sacrificed it. Has himself another Dark Sim in case he wants to use it. He's going to go for Dark Sim. Maybe Beakman will use a big defensive, but actually, oh, he's going to go for a heal. So that will give Chilpas, I think, a heal of his own as well. As long as you get yourself maybe like a big defensive, like a spell warden, that would have been amazing. Spell warden for spell warden. Chilpa's trying to see if he can avoid it. He does have some physical damage to attack with Beatman. The army that had his own physical damage, but the shadow damage, the diseases, those are not able to really break past the paladin's defenses as he got himself a big shield defender. Chilpa's may have to go for a death pack here. Stone, oh, reflected. Oh, not reflected. He stole a Hodge away from Beatman. He was able to lock him down for just a second. Does he get to group him out in the open? No, he does not. But the death pack is used up just to give himself a little bit more health, more of a buffer, but not really enough for him to get full on heal. Laying hands by Beatman. Another dark sim for chilled actually i think might have spell stolen a blind he might have spell stolen a blind for beatman we'll find out here in a bit he could potentially blind him let the pets coalesce and then let him attack all at once that could be really good beatman trying to see if he can escape hodge on chill but trying to see if he can avoid the army oh but the army of the undeads are chasing him down the army and the unholy dk by the way recently got buffed up by like 10 percent almost all across the board like clown shadows got buffed up with scourge strike uh death call got buffed execute got buffed oh, death call not for pvp though Sadly, Sun onto Lintedia, try to see if he can avoid it. Will not be able to use the Dark Sim against the Rogue unless it can maybe get a Cloak of Shadows from the Rogue. I don't really know if it counts. It's going to be a big blade rush for Lintedia, zooming up the platform, able to go for back to back Shadow Dance into Bambushes versus Chilpas. Try to go for them pistol shots, maybe maximize the damage. Can they keep up track onto Chilpas? Try to see if he can stay on him. Chilpas looking to avoid Lintedia for the most part, letting the pets do majority of the work. Trying to see if he can slow him down, letting the pets again just hit the Rogue in the back. But the pistols are still doing a lot of work. Try to see if he can maybe go for a grip, maybe get a couple of death strikes, uh, death bolts flying in. As Lethadia did use a killing speed to reduce some of the damage taken blind by the death that into full stun. Lethadia does not have a trinket for this one, use the human ratio, so it's going to be a bit of a DR for the two, surrounded by the army of the dead. And this one chills, I think, just try to see if he can avoid Lethadia. Glock of Shadows, use, no, not Cloak. Shadow Dance, used by the Rogue, does give himself some healing through see the darkness, but the Mage of the Dead is going to hit you with the Frost Bolts, slowing you down, gripping you back into the army of the dead, and this is where Chilpas takes you out. Get busted in, trying to see if he can fight the Chills, got himself reflected immediately, going to be a Storm Bolt to follow. Chilpas walking into this one with not a lot left. Reflected a Chain of Ice back at himself, but I think it's going to be down, busted. Not going to get busted down by the Z, the, this Death Knight, this time around. Just struck him up next as an Affliction Warlock, trying to see if he can make a big play. Gonna be Gev busted and charging out over and destruct him. Gonna be immediately dark back, reflect up for the warrior in case he maybe can bypass some kind of a big CC or maybe one of the big dots from Destructum charging back in not really taking that much damage he is fully dotted out but so far he's been able to really offset a lot of the damage to a second wind or ignore pain rather bored by Destructum trying to go for a big drain into busted busted maybe can slay the demon if he can do that he may be able to get himself another impending picture he doesn't have the pet dotted up right now charging out over Destructum does he have any more mobility trying to maintain the dots the best he can storm about to fall does go for the trinket so rod i think reflected back at him drain life to follow does he have it is going to be a quick intro because Busted does get dotted up though but he's still got dots as whisper when charging at him try to see if you can maybe take the man out of the game right now real quickly got himself a trick off the bat as whisper goes in for storm bolt big blade storm mad damage bury up for get busted so you might actually be okay for a bit here gonna be a charge for whisper goes like there's gonna be another blade storm for get busted as well but that's gonna be a parry up for whisper so defensively both of the words are down bleed onto whisper when maybe in a bit of trouble though that bleed together with pressure form get busted in might be a little bit rough here there's gonna be another storm bolt blade storm to follow trying to see if we can play super defensive get busted may just need one more execute he does get it two broken gonna be up next as a mark switch from hunter Silence out of buzzing for a second. Does go for the darker and racial. Trying to see if he can get himself a charge him. Definitely needs to go for some kind of heal. Whatever heal you can get is at least able to get a dot or two onto broken. Does he have anything left? It looks like he's going to be a kill shot together with a death shot. Come taking him out. That was fairly quick. If he can get himself a good snapper shot combo, that could be huge. Steel trap? 
Onto the Seabike. Does catch him into a knock back out in the open. Away from Pillar. That's going to be huge. Big snapper shot. Does do quite a bit of damage. Spell skill with a breath to follow. Got himself at least a little bit of CC. Knock back and broken. I think got himself the ult time. So it may be okay. At least it looked like the ult time. It is ult time. Does give himself at least a little bit of a better positional. But still took a lot of damage. That uh, snapper shot still stays with you. Does check him doing quite a bit of damage. Even though that's not the ult time attacking him. It's just the death check him ripping right through you. That thing does a lot of damage. Flare around the corner in case to else still try to see if he can get himself a bit of a reset. Does he have a Hunter's Mark on him? I don't think he does. Ring of Frost almost catches him. Does get caught in the Ring of Frost. I think he wanted to do it on purpose just to give himself the DR. Going to be an Ice Block on a Spell Skill. Does get interrupted, but it's going to be able to juke out. Bastard on two, two broken. Oh, the Archimage turned it around. Oh, Diabolicals, you better give this boy an honor duel. Diabolicals does not want to do it. He knows what's going to happen. He knows what's going to happen. He doesn't want to let it happen. <laughs> oh, no. Spells are trying to see if he can back up out of the heat. He doesn't want to die on him. Uh, he only used Ice Block. He's trying to see if he can go for food, but the Succubus is not going to let you. <laughs> Let's see if it's not going to think back. Oh, how do you escape this? You need an ultra type. You need a uh, shifting power. You need something, anything. Shifting power to give you some sort of cooldown reduction. And you need to find a way to deal with the succubus. Try to see if you can avoid Diabolical as best as you can. If Diabolical goes for a curse, but still can always just remove it. So Diabolical may just want to use for whatever it is to cast damage he can. So conflagrations is going to open up a portal. But still is able to get himself at least a little bit of shielding. Oh, that was pain. Got himself a ring of frost in case the succubus is going to run at him. As long as succubus does not have a good angle on you, you should be okay. Oh, able to get himself a little bit of heal. Board out for Diabolical because that's getting himself frozen. But it's gonna be supposed to try to see if we can win the second, but he's doing whatever he can just escape this. Oh my god, that is insane. Trying to sit down for food, he needs himself an invis really badly. Ma uh, proper invis is actually available. Are you gonna slam out? He looks like he wants to go for a bit of damage versus spell steel or versus diabolicals. Got himself the full Kyrie and Radiant Spark, full invis. Does he have himself a proper go? Gonna be CC. Oh, this is just not that. You're alive, you got cancer both and you're still alive. How? Oh man, that is rough. That is rough. If only Diabolicals gave him even a chance, I feel like that would have been a hell of a duel. Reflect up. More to call him to Kevin. You should be sure. Actually, careful with that reflect. Now that there's no reflect, you can definitely go for a full hodge. As long as he doesn't run over the ledge, he'll be okay. Second miss here right after. Does he go for the trinket? Big hammer hanging over Diabolical's head. Try to see if he can port him out. It's going to be a little more careful. Chaos Bolt portal opening it up. It's just going to blast him out. Diabolical's jumping down, hammer slamming down on him. Kevin's super low on health. May decide to go for a bubble. Diabolical's definitely going to go for a port. Doesn't go as far as he wanted to. Kevin still is on his side of the guy. Can maybe, can he maybe catch up to him potentially try to go for flash lights but that may not be the play because the man just got so much range on you you can just hit you from a distance oh no and that's over now about because he's seen himself like a second just a moment to be able to take these boys out of here God, destruction is good. Get busted. Got them. So three Chopas with two. Diabolical with two. Seawork almost made it back. If only he was given a proper honor duel. He did a lot of damage though, too. To the hunter. That was a lot. <laughs> that was a ton. All right, boys. Let's get this as another going, yeah?